Hey, this is Naomi from TaskTop. Today I'm going to show you how TaskTop integrates Sparks EA via Sparks Pro Cloud Server with Jama and Jira to maximize productivity for product owners, business analysts, and developers. The integration helps create a completely visible and traceable requirements management process. I'm going to walk you through a common scenario of synchronizing requirements, their dependencies, and metadata between three different tools. The tools in our example are JAMA, a requirements management tool, Sparks EA via Sparks Pro Cloud Server, a requirements modeling tool, and JIRA, an agile planning tool. TaskTop supports many other tools in the IT tool chain, so even if you don't use this precise tool combo, you'll still find this video useful. You can see the three tools we'll be using in our demo right here in TaskTop Landscape View. And you can see that what flows between them in our scenario are requirements. Before we jump into the tools themselves so we can see each practitioner's experience, I'll tell you real quick what we're going to do today in the demo. In our demo, a product owner defines a high-level requirement in JAMA. When it's ready for design, TaskTop flows the requirement from JAMA to Sparks EA via Sparks Pro Cloud Server where a business analyst will further model and define it in preparation for implementation. The BA creates two child requirements. Once she completes her work, she'll set the child requirements to ready for approval. Any updates to the original requirement plus the two new child requirements will flow to JAMA. When the product owner approves the requirements in JAMA, TaskTop will flow the requirements to JIRA as stories. During the demo, I'll show you how the work items, along with their fields, comments, statuses, and custom tags, all flow from tool to tool to help eliminate duplicate data entry, email exchanges, and status meetings. So let's get started. Starting in JAMA, the product owner defines a business requirement for his company's online store. This requirement specifies that customers should be able to save items in their cart for later. He creates the requirement, enters a name, a description, and a priority. He sets the planned release, adds the tag cart, and then saves and closes the requirement. When he's ready, he changes the status of the requirement to ready for design. Let's see what happens in Sparks EA. Because its status is ready for design, TaskTop has flowed the requirement to Sparks EA. You can see that it appears here with its name, description, status, tags, and metadata, all mapped to the respective fields. The alias field also displays the unique ID of the original JAMA requirement for traceability. For terminology consistency, the BA decides to make a slight update to the original requirement. She adds the term deferred items to the requirement's name. Now she starts breaking down the high-level requirements into more detailed requirements. She creates two new requirements based on the original. She creates a dependency between them. She then positions them both as child requirements of the original JAMA requirement. While modeling the requirements, the business analyst can exchange questions and comments with the product owner under discussions. In JAMA, the product owner sees the comment and responds. In Sparks EA, the BA receives the response. When the BA completes her work on the requirements, she changes their status to waiting for approval. Switching back to JAMA, we can see that the original requirements name has been updated. We can also see that the new requirements created by the business analyst have been replicated into JAMA, maintaining the child relationship defined in Sparks EA. The dependency relationship between the two child requirements has also been maintained. The product owner reviews the requirements, and once satisfied, he sets their priority and planned release and changes their status to ready for implementation. 
Let's switch to JIRA. The requirements appear on the developer's to-do list as stories with all the information from JAMA and Spark CA. As the work on them progresses through the development team's workflow, changes to their statuses will be visible in both JAMA and Spark CA. Our three practitioners worked seamlessly with each other, never having to leave their tool of choice, never having to copy and paste information, and never having to send an email. Once you have a fully linked and traceable process for handling requirements using TaskTop, you can create some extremely useful metrics around lead time, from ideation through implementation. The beauty of TaskTop is that it flows artifacts and automates handoffs across your entire tool chain, so you can accelerate delivery and respond faster to your customers. And it's easy. TaskTop has a friendly, entirely graphical interface where you configure the integrations with surgical precision. That was just a short look at TaskTop. We've got lots more to share with you. So learn more about how TaskTop can help you get work done in IT at tasktop.com.